Bhakti Services was started in 2017. Currently, the hospital has 960 beds, out of which 200 beds are ventilatory beds, and our bed occupancy ranges from 85% to 100%, and with an average 100, around 60 admissions per day. We have different ICUs, NICU, PICU, Pediatric ICU, Neonatal ICU, Trauma ICU, and uh, medical ICU, surgical ICU. So since the inception, 2.5 lakh patients have been treated in our indoor of the hospital. We also provide daycare admission facility. And approximately 9,000 patients per year are treated on daycare basis. Till now, 46,000 patients have been treated on daycare basis. We have OPDs. Uh, uh, across all specialties and super specialties, including the Ayush, we have a separate wing of Ayush, and we have a lifestyle medicine care facility also here. Our OPD uh, is about uh, 60,000 per, uh, per month, and till now we have seen 38 lakh patients in this hospital. We have 54 operation theatres, out of these 25 are modular theatres and uh, some are minor theatres and uh, normal theatres. We do uh, perform all surgical specialties here, like inclusive of all CTVS surgeries, neurosurgeries, oncosurgeries, etc. And on an average, we perform 8,000 surgeries in a year currently, and uh, minor surgical procedures like 6,000 per year. Till now, we have done 48,000 major surgeries and 40,000 minor surgeries. The another feather in the cap of our institution is uh, we do perform robotic surgeries also. And till now, we have done 1,100 robotic surgeries. We have dedicated coronary cath lab with two equipments, radiotherapy units, with a long waiting list as well. We have advanced robotic rehabilitation in our physical medicine rehabilitation department. We have eye bank with a corneal transplant facility. We have a very good state of art technology blood bank. We have a bone bank. In our radio diagnostics, we have two MRIs, three CTs, and we have a DSA for neuro intervention facilities. Our central laboratory is well equipped, catering to pathology, microbiology, biochemistry, and we do also have molecular lab. We have dialysis facility with 26 beds. And our emergency services run 24 into 7. On an average, 28,000 patients per year, they come to our OPDs in emergency services. We have a very state-of-art technology advanced trauma center. And uh, they are uh, sort of like a boon to this uh, hilly area because all the patients of accidents from the high hill areas, remote areas, they are brought here. And uh, we are fortunate to have like a helipad and the patients are brought with the heli services. And uh, another thing like uh, Civil Aviation Ministry is going to uh, start heli services on a regular basis for AIMS Rishikesh and they are going to offer us two helicopters for power hunts which would be here regularly. During COVID pandemic, our hospital had uh, done a lot uh, for the patients and it has been a dedicated COVID hospital with 400 beds that time. Apart from that, we have a DRDO hospital, which was two kilometers from here. And in total, we catered to 5,000 patients suffering from COVID. And uh, Mucor, you know that Mucor occurred in the second wave, and our hospital did 433 surgeries for the Mucor patients. The digitalization in our hospital in a partial mode I mean, the institution is a partial mode. In hospital is now e-hospital facilities there for the last four years. And uh, Ayushman Bharat Yojana, we are catering to it. 92,000 patients have been uh, provided services under Ayushman Bharat scheme. We have also already started Ayushman Bharat digital mission. And uh, total, we have now generated 2,000 uh, 2, ABHA IDs. And 4,300 are linked. Our hospital uh, practitioners, uh, they have been linked uh, under this scheme. 300 have been linked. In the future, we are extending our services 
with, uh, with the upcoming 42 bedded pediatric ICU and 150 bedded ICU for general ICU. So another next uh, one and a half year, these services would be started. And we are coming up uh, with our several advanced centers in different specialties. And another, lastly, we are coming, uh, the work already has been started, we are coming up with Kumayu Center of Ames Rishikesh, which is uh, will be commissioned, I think, in a two years' time. So with this, uh, this is uh, like uh, we are going away and uh, we, with our uh, director from Ames Rishikesh and uh, Ames Dairy and uh, Professor P.K. Um, with Anthan, uh, we 